Good morning, YouTube. Tennessee Wingman back with you. Finally met up with the group, Faith Riders, Glenville. We're headed out on a ride. Got Donnie and his wife in the trike in the front. Preacher next, and the uh, little Bergman scooter 650. Pretty nice little bike. Got Roxy and her boyfriend on that Harley there. I'm sitting in the back getting all the noise, but I'm enjoying it. So, since I'm not uh, familiar with the area and I don't know where we're going, and I'm new to, to here. I'll let them show me around. Maybe we'll uh, catch up. Be leading it before long. We're headed to some restaurant out uh, the other side of Metter. It's about 50 miles from here. We'll turn around and be back this afternoon to take Becky to uh, dinner for our anniversary. But in the meantime, man, what a day. We got 75 degrees, partly cloudy. Just a really nice, nice, cool morning. I told you earlier about me driving the bus, but and let me get throw you in on what's gonna be happening the rest of the year. So far, I've done 12,000 miles this year. Uh, man, I'm still going. Been to Tennessee three times. Uh, several different trips. Went down to Florida. And first one thing and then the other. A lot of rides locally, back and forth to work. I'm hoping to hit 15,000 by the end of the year, but that's probably not going to happen. I have a surgery planned for uh, December. They're going to work on my eyelids. So my eyelids are drooping down and affecting my vision. Also, a little later, for after the first of the year, I'm going to have to have a cataract taken out there. It sucks getting old, don't it? Dang. February, we got a cruise. Wingers and waves. Bunch of gold wingers on a cruise. Yeah, it don't get very wild. <laughs> but we have a, always have a good time meeting our friends, seeing our friends again and spending time with them. And we're going to the Cayman Islands and Cancun or Cozumel, I forget which one. Intersection, you turn right and go down to my house. We're gonna have a Christmas party in December in Tennessee with the chapter there. We always have a great time to go up there to do that. This will be the second year we've had to go up there to do that last year and this year. We missed the fall color ride that was this week. They're out there doing that now. But with the job that I took, it's kind of hard to get off work initially. But it's about the easiest job I've ever had. I don't understand how it could be that easy. But it's not like a school bus where the kids are screaming and yelling all day and run rudely and all that kind of thing. It's over to college. Kids get on the bus, they got their phones in their ear or their tablets or whatever. They get on, they sit down, they never say a word. Get up, get off, never say a word. It's kind of like you're in your own little head. The only thing I wish they'd do is let us have music on the bus, but they don't. So you just got to sit there and be in your own mind. It's peanut season here. They harvested peanuts. And uh, 
you go down the road and big clouds of dirt where they're digging up the peanuts and you can smell them you know you ever been around raw peanuts you can smell the raw peanuts and I suppose not a whole lot of pumpkins grow down here I haven't seen many pecan season will be in November There'll be a whole lot of activity there. There's a whole lot of pecan orchards around here. A whole lot. I see people out there every day picking up stray limbs and leaves and getting rid of the debris because the way they harvest pecans is pretty, pretty weird for most folks. They go out and they put tarps around the trees. Big tarps. And then they reach a machine, it reaches and grabs a hold of the tree and it shakes that tree. And all the peanuts fall out. Then they pick them up off the tarp. Pretty smart. But that's how you get a lot of peanuts in a very short period of time. Because that's some back breaking work trying to bend over and pick those things up all day. much more to say so we'll cut this short get off here maybe we'll start another one here later wingman's out